Good afternoon, everyone. Namaste. It's time to practice again. So today we're doing core and um, very simple. We're going to be just doing sit up for one hour. Sounds good? No, just kidding. <laughs> no, we won't be doing sit up for one whole hour. It, I'm just making a joke. I'm trying to wake you, wake you guys up because um, you know, half day today, right now, and some of you may be working already all morning from home or in the office. So we are going to be doing core today. So we are going to be flowing while we are doing all the core um, focus uh, asanas. So before we start our core, um, I would like to just um, make an announcement on a few things. Um, because a lot of people are saying that um, with my personal Instagram class yesterday, uh, you cannot really see um, the video after the practice, uh, like in the Facebook, that you can re-watch it over and over again. So you were requesting me to do my uh, personal class on Facebook instead of on Instagram. I can just tell you, I will be posting them on my Facebook page so you can always re-watch on Facebook so you won't be um, missing any of my classes. Come on. 有些朋友跟我說,如果IG的class就會看不到,因為24小時後就會沒有了,我就想跟大家說,就不需要擔心我,就會將我的class全部都會放在上面。我自己的Facebook I have been receiving a lot of comments from you guys, and thank you all for your support for the last couple of weeks. And um, again, I would like to uh, remind you guys to please share the video with people that you know, introduce yoga to their life. And also, uh, when you comment, if you don't mind, tell me a little bit about yourself, where you're from, and how long you have been practicing yoga, what kind of yoga is your favorite practice, so we get to know each other better. And I try my best to uh, reply you and to um, have a little bit of uh, interaction and communication with you. 今天可以的話,我也希望你可以說一說你自己在哪裡 so, um, we are going to start our practice core today. So, let's go back to the mat and get ready for the practice. 那我們現在回到那張椅子那裡,準備我們開始練習。首先打坐一陣間先, first we're going to sit uh, on the meditative position, and if you like to use block, go ahead and grab a block, or just use some towels, just to uh, use it as a padding or as elevation for your seat. 我們可以坐在磚度,或者坐在毛巾上面,如果你沒磚,坐直坐高就打坐。So let's go back to the mat and start. So you can see my full body now, and uh, very funny, my daughter saw me. She said, Mom, you look like a highlighter. Okay? So I said, yes, that's the purpose. I would like you to see the pose better, so exactly like uh, the purpose of a highlighter when you can see everything much easier, much better. Alright, so shoulders down. Sit tall. So we are done with all the chit chats. And let's start our meditation position. Place your hands on your knees with your palms facing up or facing down, whichever is more comfortable for you. Close your eyes and soften the face. Breathe in deep and slow.
this is a time when you try to connect your breath with your body so we don't really pay attention to how we breathe because it's something natural we don't have to think about it but when you practice yoga is when you are turning your focus inward and try to breathe a little deeper a little longer 我們平時的呼吸,我們所有去想,自然會做的,自然會發生的。練習瑜伽的時候呢,我們就集中諗下個呼吸。拉長啲,慢啲。向內留意下自己的身體。Turn your focus inward and scanning through the body, noticing how you are feeling today. 雙手合掌放在胸前。One arm to start our practice. 一個按下。Inhale. practice. Just a simple reminder before we start, remember all the poses start from basic step and build it up to advanced level. So stop at any point that you can manage. Do not go over your limits. Right? Now let's do some core work. And in our core class, lie down on the back. From there, they have to sit. We So bring your your knees towards your chest. Draw your knees in. And keep your spine flat. And feel the abdominal muscle pulling down. And stretch your legs straight up towards the ceiling. Sun is it got hung so and bring your hands behind your head. So just a few simple moves first to wake up the body, to wake up your core. Lift the shoulders up, elbows to the side. Now contraction in the abs. Pull your navel down. If you cannot keep the knees straight, bend the knees. Right, and now your right leg down and up and left leg down and up and down and up and down and up. Lift your shoulders high and engage your abdominal muscles. And then you can go a little bit faster, double up the speed. Lift up and down, contract the abs, really focus in this area. Draw the navel down. Hold it here. Low Five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here. And one. Now bring your knees in, bring your shoulders down. Alright, hold that now this next one, keep the legs straight again and drop the feet 45 degrees. So the challenge is when your leg comes back up, you cannot bring it higher than 45. So right here, you're going down 
and come back halfway. Down and come back halfway. You have to stop 45 degrees. Bend the knees if you cannot straighten. 翻转头唔准超过四十五度吓。好 ，Let's go. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. You can double the speed. 可以双倍嘅速度。You keep the legs straight or slightly bent. Bend your knees a little bit easier for lower back problems. 有腰痛嘅咧，少少曲下。Five, four, three, two, and one. Draw your knees in and relax your shoulders down. 放低喺个地下度。All right. So the next one, we're gonna keep the legs straight again. But lower, much lower to the to the floor. How can they hide it? So really working on your lower part of your abdomen. Right, keep the legs straight first. Lift the shoulders up. Keep your heels about 20 degrees. Elbows to the side, and now down, up, down, up, down, up. And you can double the speed. They call it that top. Very small movement. Faster feel a little bit easier to handle. 好似快啲會容易少少添。Hold it here. Lift the shoulders higher. Five, four, three, two, and change. Bring your knees in. Bring your shoulders down. 好啦，我哋曲翻嘅膝頭哥嚇。Now the next one, you're gonna keep your knees bent, and then you keep the left knees bent, and keep your um, excuse me, your right knee bend, your left leg straight. Bring it up to 90, bring your hands together, and bring it to the right side. Reach your hands together and twist to the right side. Alright, so now the right leg and your hands stay, no change. Yow gut, long as out, yup. Go deep, you know, jing hayoko joga, left leg down, up, down, up, down. Down, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight, up, nine, up, ten, up, and hold it here. Reach forward more. Three, two, and one. Come back. Now, second side. Left knee bend, right leg straight. And hand to the left side, and then your right leg down, up, two, up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight, up, nine, up, ten, up, and hold for three, two. And one. Now bend the knees, bring your knees towards your chest, and relax your tummy. All right, so you can feel your abdominal muscles. This area is a little bit burning. So a lot of poses, we need to use the core. So the benefit to have strong core, it's, uh, you find it's a lot easier for you to get into different asanas. At the same time, in your daily life, if you have strong core, and uh, you can avoid a lot of accidents, you will bet, you'll be better in your balance, and uh, very, very many benefits from it. You have a core, it's very soft, you can do pose very easily, and in your daily life, there are many places where you can do it. You can do it with your knees. Now, catch your back of your knees, and roll up here. We'll turn your head. All right, so I'm going to face you guys, so you can see better. All right, here, we'll turn your hands a little bit. Bring your hands to the chest, so have journal or hat. Lift the chest. Now bring your feet same high as your knees. Alright, so keep your hands both just as I walk. And now straighten your legs and bend your knees. Use your core straight and bend. Now you do don't run your back spine. Straight and bend. And four. And back, and five, and back, and six, and.
and back. Bring your feet higher, toe toe. Straight and back. And straight and back. And, and back. And three more. And back. And two. And back. And one. And bend. Chest up more. Hold your chest up. You got to go a little bit. My friend's friend. Lift your chest up. Three. Two. And one. Feet to the floor. And hold your knees. All right, so we're gonna come to all fours. So you know this is a core focus class. We will have a lot more exercise to help strengthen the core. So come to all four first, and then we do a few rounds of cat cat, and just to loose up the tummy and warm up the spine more. In cat cat, spread your fingers wide, hands under the shoulders, knees under your hips. All right, chest down and chest in and two and in and three and in and four and in and arch and round and stay here. Now here we're gonna try to work your core again by. A little bit of a variation. It's called floating tabletop, right? So the hands stays, knees stays, and feet sink. Now first, draw your navel in, toes is out, sink, and then you puff the upper back up, draw some good core sink. Now when you puff the upper back, you do not round the shoulders forward. Shoulders still away from the ears. Good. Now lift the knees two inches off the floor, two inches. That's it. Nice one, Janet. Yeah, I'm calling so many names because I know I can see some of my friends. They are in uh, online with me. I can see them, the poses. Yeah, round your spine. Look behind. Look towards your feet. Suck your stomach in. Draw your navel in. Shoulders away from your ears. Rounding your spine a little bit more. Draw your body up, 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 and hold it. Five here. Pull your navel in and up. Contraction in the abdominal muscles. Two. And slowly push back to downward facing dog. Stretch it out. Spread your fingers wide. Push the floor. Relax your neck. Downward facing dog. Set on lies up there. Lies up there. So use this opportunity to stretch out the whole body, and we then come back to do a little bit more. Of the variation, tabletop variation, right? So relax your neck. You can bend the knees, wiggle your hips. You have a pain hole. Push the floor. So lie on the lie on the hands, turn on the dead heart. Relax your neck. Suck your stomach in. Spine is long. Now come back to tabletop here. Right, we're gonna do a few variations here. Now, work on the core. That means you really need to suck your stomach in and making sure your stomach is nice and engaged. So, it's like a toe lamp. Yeah. Now, touch your toes and slightly pull your navel in. Right. So you don't run the bike spine so much like a, uh, a cow pose. You can basically just puff in a little bit flat back. All right. Extend your right arm straight. And your left arm, left leg back. So as I'm using selfie, so my right and left look to you maybe opposite, but you guys right arm, left leg. Because using selfie camera, so you left, 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 Sideway, left leg to the left. 打完嘅右手，打完嘅左脚。Upward airplane. Now bring it back to extension, forward and back. 去翻前面。And now bring it side. 去側邊。Get lift to the side. Upward airplane. And come back to the front. And hold it. And go to the side. And now, 
Right arm to the right, left leg to the left. Draw your navel in. Come back to the front, extension. Sideway, number four. Extension. Forward. Sideway, and hold it here. Lift the leg high. If this is too hard for you, you can bend the knee. Lift your leg high. Use your core. Look forward, one spot. Arms straight, leg straight. Sideway, awkward airplane. Three, core strong. Two, and one, forward. And hands down. Good, knees on the floor. Hands down. I am sweating and a little bit huffing and puffing. I'm sure you guys are all feeling the same. All right, now let's do side two. Now very important, you do not dump all your weight to your wrist, all right? So you want to draw the navel in, make your hands light. Okay, you have more like this side of the shoulder. Oh, left leg, excuse me, opposite. Right leg, left arm. Same fan, the wall. Draw so, you go. Good. And now, to the side. Make sure you have space to extend the leg. Core strong. And reach forward. And reach back. And side. Number two. And number three, forward and back, and side, and four, forward and back, and side, and last one, forward, and now side, lift your leg high, suck your stomach in, hold it here, core strong, push the floor with your hand, Lift your leg higher. Use your core to steady the pose. Three, two, and one. Hands down and back and sit down to child's pose. Move your hips, forehead to the floor. Hold three, two, and one. Now come back to all four. Still in the all four position. One more variation here. Alright, bring your knees together. Lift your right leg up. Bend your right knee. Bring your heel closer towards your bum. Lift the knees high. Draw your navel in. Now, if you need to balance in this posture, use your core. Pull your navel in. Left hand reach to hold your right foot. Kick your foot. Hold your hands onto the ankle and kick. You will soak the toe. The hand will hold your gut. You know, head go core nice and tight, engaging the muscles in your abdomen. Soak the toe. Three, two, and one. Lower down. Second side. Left leg. Lift. Bend your knee. Right arm reach. Suck your stomach in, and bring your hand to hold your foot. And kick, tackle, suck your stomach in, kick up, eyes looking forward, Yung sau hai yang hai jik, line to your gut, to your gut, yang hai jik sau. Draw your navel in, three, two, and one, lower down, my mind of funny. Good, now come to downward facing dog, one more time, downward facing dog. Spread your fingers wide. So deep that high. And stay. Keep breathing. Hold to the full cup. Now high plank. It's the most basic posture that you use your core to hold the posture. This is a very common pose we always do in our practice. Ping ban ha high push up. Navel draw up and in. Contraction in your abdomen area and downward facing dog. Again, I push up, set your stomach in, draw your navel in, and downward facing dog. Now we do one more time, I push up. On the third one, look forward, lift your right leg up, draw your navel in and up. 
right leg up. Push the floor. Contraction in the abs. So it's like a toe. And right foot down. And left foot up. Contraction in the abs. Look forward, mountain. Push the foot. Draw your navel in and up. Close your side up. And down. Down, I'm facing back. Step forward, hands in hand. Halfway lengthen the spine. Forward fold. Catch your elbows. Hold your opposite elbows. Drop the head nice and heavy towards the floor. The head is strong and it's holding on to the floor. Hands to the floor. Sow for the head. And now hands to the hips and come all the way up to standing. Good. So let's flow a little bit. We're going to flow. So let's flow. So let's flow. So let's flow. So let's flow. Joy, find, find, they focus on your foot, and then we come back to the core. Bring your hands together. Now, inhale, reach up. Exhale, fold. Halfway up. Step back. Look forward. You can do a full version, low push up. And come up to cobra pose or upward dog. Look up. Down with facing dog. Lift your heels, look forward, step, jump to your hands. Halfway up, inhale, and fold. Reach up, and hands down to the chest. Bend the knees, Ukkasthasana. Sit your hips low, bring your chest up, bring your waist to your heels. Now here, you need to use your core also. Chest lifting, forward fold. Halfway up, inhale, high push up. Now, full version, bend your elbows, low push up. Come up to cobra or upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Right foot forward, left foot down. Warrior one. Arms switch up. Sit your hips lower. Square your shoulders and hip to the front. Chodai siu siu ke yan ha. Jeng hang chin fong ya gu go bop pao. Tama yo pun wa. Hands to the floor. High push up, core strong, cobra or up dog, down and face it. Left foot forward, warrior one. Arms reach up, the back foot is flat. Reach your arms up, hold it. Square your shoulders, hands to the floor. High push up, lower, cobra or up the face. Downward facing dog. Stay here. Five. Spread your fingers wide. Relax your neck. Three. And now look forward. Step your right foot between your hands. Lift the left heel up. Anjan Asana. Arms reach up. All right, now here, back leg strong. Right knee bend, and now you should tell me, draw your navel in, and now lean forward. Feel that you're engaging your abdominal muscle to steady the posture. Now, yong like half the toe, tag. Pull your navel in and up. Right now, with the left heel lift. All right, so I'm going to move myself back so you can see my full body, and now you go to warrior three. Warrior three. Arms reaching forward. Hands are facing in. Summer strong. Core strong. Hold three, two, and one. Now hands to the floor. Now listen. Bring your left foot. Don't touch the floor. Next to the right. Move in there, you are. Lift your left leg up to the side. Use your core. If you can balance, reach your left arm up. Look up. Jog up toe head. Bring it to parallel with the left hip, and bring your hands down. Left foot back. Hands to the floor. Right leg up. Bend your right knee. Turn your navel. 
Stretch that hip. Push the floor. Right foot on the floor. Yeah. Look forward. Left foot forward. High lunge. Arms reach up. Sit your hips lower. Bend your left knee deeper. Right knee straight. Right heel lifts. Now again, I'm going to move myself. So to make sure you guys all see me. Lean 45 degrees. Suck your summer in. Core nice and strong. And now lift up to warrior three. Palms facing in. Lift your leg high. Draw your lower abdomen in. Steady. Stay. Palms facing in. So set the whole arm. Then I'll light in. Good. Now hands to the foot. Bring your right foot back next to the left. Don't touch the floor. Lift your right leg up. Right, bring it high. As high as your hip. And if your foot is high up, reach your right arm up. Look up to your head. Nice and tight, lower abdomen. Look up. Good. Hands to the floor. Bring your foot back to the back of your mat. Left leg up. Bend your left knee. Turn your hips. Hold it. Three, two, and one. Left foot down. Good. Now we continue. We're going to hold it. Right foot forward. Warrior two. Arms reaching out. Warrior two. Bend your knee. I can feel my core light on fire. I'm sure you guys are feeling something. Bring your right arm to the right thigh. Left hip lower. Now today, we don't bring your hand too low, the lower arm, the right arm. All right, because we're working the core. Left arm reach up. Left arm, touch your left ear. Suck your stomach in. Now we focus on the midsection. Now, beautiful, Janet. Now two arms stretching. Two arms parallel. Use your core. Now you can go lower or higher. Find which angle helping you to teach yourself that you need to engage your core. Sometimes some angle you totally don't need to. So challenge yourself by bringing your body lower or higher. He is a good one. 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 Three, two, and warrior two. Straighten your right leg. Walk your left foot in slightly. Chukkanasana. Right hand to the ship. Left hand towards the ceiling. And look up to your left hand. All right, again, we're going to do similar arms here. So this one is a little bit more work for the core. Left arm parallel to the left ear. Suck your stomach in. Very strong core. So let me move myself back so you can see my hands. All right, now, two arms. Right. Your body is still in a straight line. Good. Turn your right armpit towards the front. Left armpit towards the ceiling. Nice and strong core. Three, two, and one. Come back to parallel arms. Good job, Scary One. Turn your right foot in parallel with your left foot. Hands to the hips. Just take a simple forward fold here. Out forward. Bring your hands behind your heels or behind your calf. Bring your forehead close towards the floor. Legs are straight. Chest open. Three, two, and one. Now come up. Walk your hands to the front. All right. Bring your left knee to the floor. And reach your arms up. Good. Bring your right hand to your hip. Take a twist. Left elbow, right knee. Now, loose up the body and let your body twist more. Twist and twist and twist. And now, once you are at the maximum twist, engage abdominal muscles. Bring your hands together. Stay here. Now, you can stay. Extend your leg. 
the back leg. Spread your left hand down. Reach your right arm up. And activate your core. Bring your right arm. And some of you can bring your left arm. All right, so core stop. Three. Hold it here. Two. And change hands to the floor. Down facing up. Spread your fingers wide. Keep breathing. Three breaths here. Left foot forward. Warrior two. Arms reaching. Bend your knee. Two arms straight. Right, left forearm to the left thigh. Right arm reach up to the ceiling. Sit your hip low, but the body stay higher. Working on extending two arms. Use your core. Extend your right arm. Yao Sao Bei Ti Ha. And then your left. Jiao Sao Bei. So you go lower or higher. Find your edge. Find a place you can use the edge. And stay. Open up the chest. Let it open. Turn your body more towards the ceiling. Core nice and tight. Three. Hold it here. Straight leg. And change. Warrior two. Straighten your left leg. Walk your back foot in. Lean to the left. Trikonasana. Left hand to the shin. Right arm reach up. Look up. Stay here. Two legs strong. Pull your navel in. Engaging the muscle in your abdomen area. And bring your arm close to your ear. Turn your chest. Now two arms parallel. Very strong abs. Strong arms. Whole body engage. Straight lines. Take side and side. Three. Right shoulder back, left shoulder forward. Two. And change. Come back. Turn your left foot in. Bring your hands behind. Interlace your fingers. Draw your hands down. And fold. Look back this time. Just relax everything. Hold. Three. Two. And change. Come back. Hands to your hips. Turn to the front. Right knee down. Reach your arms up. Right elbow, left knee. Get two hands prayer. Now you can stay. You can straighten the back leg. Right. And you can spread your arms. Core nice and tight. Left arm reach up. Left arm touch your left ear. Twisting. And then two arms stretching. Turn your right chest. Right chest to the left, left chest to the back. Hold it here. Eyes looking straight or turn up to the ceiling. Three, two, and one. Now hands down. Down with facing dog. How goes it? Push back. Take a vinyasa. High push up. Knees, chin, and chest. Cobra. Down with facing up. Stay here. Spread your fingers. Step your feet halfway up. And come up to standing. Reach your arms up. Hands down to the chest. Good. So you guys feeling alright? I hope, but I'm sweating also. <laughs> so we're gonna do some balancing poses here. All right, so we're gonna focus more on the posture that we work on the core. So put your hands on your hips. Shift the weight to the left leg. Lift up your right. All right, so you use your abdominal muscles to keep that knee there. All right, now you bring your hands behind. Interlace your fingers. Stretch your arms back, extend your leg forward. Point your toes, bring your foot down, use your core, straight leg, lift it up, one, 
down, lift it up, two, down, use your core, lift it up, three, down, lift it up, four, down, lift it up, five, and hold, use your core, three, two, and one, bend your knee, feet together, okay, second side, hands in your hips, left leg, straighten your left leg, bring your hands behind, Keep your chest lift, point your toes. Down, use your abs. Lift it up, one. Down, lift it up, two. Down, use your core. Three, down, four, down, five and hold for three, two, and change. Feet together, good. Now from here, you're going to bend the right leg, catch your foot with your both hands. All right, balancing, kick your right leg back, stretch your arms straight. So here, your hands not pulling your leg. Instead, your leg kicking your head. Your hand is not to the foot, the foot, the and then when you're at the maximum kick, charge your body down. Chest open. Kick. Chest open. Kick. Good. And change. And come back. Now side two. Hold your foot. Bring your hands. Holding your ankles. Eyes look forward. And now kick. Arch your body back. Kick. When you're at the maximum kick, you're just going to arch your body. So I'm going to move to position that you can see better. Chest lift. Kick. And change. Come back. Feet together. Alright. Just a tree. Simple tree. Right foot inside the left side. Bring your hands together. Reach your arms up. We take it to a side bend here. Bring your right hand down. Stretch your right arm straight. Lean over to the right. Left shoulder back, right shoulder forward. Stay. Bending tree. Two arms long and straight. Long as I'll take side. And change. Come back. Hands down. Second side, there you be. Left foot. Bring your hands together. So help you. Reach up, Michael. And lower your left hand. Draw so lovely. Reach your arm and lean towards the left. Nyai hang draw bin. Alright, eyes looking straight. Mong to come to. Good. Lean to the left, side stretch. Good. And change. Hands down. Feet together. I reach up, inhale, four, down with facing up, now we're going to do a couple more for the abs and then we will hit the floor, do some back bends and then do a little bit of forward bend to counter, right, now keep your feet together, come to a high push up, we're going to go side plank, right, for the first side plank, the right heel, the right edge of your foot, outer edge on the floor, left foot, on top of the right, left arm reach up. Good, now draw your navel in and up, keep your bum high, and now you're going to thread your left arm under the right, use your tummy, and lift up. Four more, thread, and lift up. Three, and lift up. Four, and live up, and five, and live up. Now from here, lift your left foot. Bring your arms up, bring your foot forward, lift it high, and back. Get very strong abs. Lift it up, bring it forward, 
and back. Lift it up. Number three, forward and back. Number four, up, forward and back. And last one, up, forward and back. And hands down. Downward facing dog. And shake your legs. I know this is very challenging. It's challenging for me too. So we are in this together. But do the best you can. Well, the feet together. Just high push up with the right foot in front of your left. Right arm reach up. Look up. And now thread. Go down. And up. One. Go down. Two. Go down. Three. Down. Four. Down. Five. Still in your side plank. And now lift your right leg up. Bring it forward. Bring it back. And down. Two. Up. Forward. Back and down. Three, forward, back and down. Four, forward, back and down. Five, forward, back and down. And child's pose. Yes, this feels good, the child's pose. Full head to the floor. Three, two, and one. Now slowly come up. And now we're gonna lie down on the tummy. Just do a couple back bends here on your tummy. How do they have to see you get one how? Good. Now we stretch your arms to the side. Make your body big opening. All right, I'm gonna go down a little bit so I have room for my arms. T shape. Chin forward. And fly up like an airplane. Chest up, legs up, everything up. Look up. Thighs up. Everything up. Keep your chest higher. Look up. Three, two, and change. Good. Look to the right. Let me touch the floor. Good. Chin forward. Now the next one. Bend the knees. Catch your feet. Now listen. This one is a little bit different from the normal bow pose. So we are going to hold your ankles, hold your ankles, all right? And then you're gonna flex the toes back, toes back. And now you wanna keep the thighs on the floor and the knees on the floor and just lift up the chest. Lift the chest. Good. Feel the nice stretch around your abdominal area. Lift up. Toes pulling back. So the knees are staying on the floor. And toes are pulling backwards. Your soles flat towards the ceiling. Hold it. Three. Two. And one. Good. Feel the nice stretch around your abdominal area. Turn Two, and change. Now from here, press up to downward facing dog. Right foot forward, left knee down. Yau ga han chi, jo sa kui de. Alright, bring your right hand to the knee, twisting to the right. Lao Hang Yao Bi. 
twisting. More. Now bring your left heel up. Jog up. Lie my leg. Bring your right hand to hold your foot. And take a twist. Now the first part. Keep the leg kicking the hand back. You want to grab the yourself and open up the chest. So you want to have your body high up. The left palm on the floor. Lean back. Open up the chest. Look up. Good. Now from here, you're going to change your position. Bring your heel closer to your bum. Using your right hand to grab your left foot. Bring your elbow to the ceiling and draw your knee and your heel closer to your bum. And if you have the flexibility, go down. Go down on your forearms. Feel the stretch in your quads and your hip flexor. Now slowly come back. My muscles are funny. Right? Now move your hands back. Straighten your front leg. Lie to the yoga. And the first part, you want to point your foot down, just stretching the top of your foot. So stay. And then part two, lift the toes. Alright, now some of you can go more. You can go to your full split or just stay in half. Lift the chest. Okay. Now You can stay here. If it's easy for you, you can go back bend or you can go forward. Or you can reach your arms up. Hold it here, half split or full. And hands down. Okay. Bring your right foot in and come down to pigeon. Bring your forehead close to the floor. As you can feel that we are closing up the practice here. Forehead to the floor pigeon. Slowly press yourself up and go back to downward facing dog. Look forward, bring your left foot between your hands, right knee down. Alright, now bring your left hand to the knee and twist it. Alright, now from here, you're starting to bring your heel close to your bum, right hip. And then reach your hand to hold your foot. Now remember the first part, we stay on the palm. Open up the chest. And twist it. Look up. So the hand is pulling the foot, the foot is kicking the head. And lean back. So you open up the left side chest to the ceiling. And now part two, bring your elbows bent, bring your heel closer to your bum. And now lower your right elbow down if you have it. If it's too much for you, keep the palm on the floor. You put high sun full like sao gum to day high the and twist it. Look up. Good. Now slowly come back. Two hands on the side of your foot. Extend the left leg straight. Joga sunze. Okay, now the first part, the toes on the floor, the boy leg man chunk. Okay, lean towards your foot. Good. Now from here, we're gonna slowly lift the toes up to do half split. Okay, now from here, 
if you have the full split, you know your own limits, you can go to a full version. Okay, so the full split, you can stay forward fold or reach your arms up. Square your body, draw your shoulders away from the ears. And then hands to the floor and slowly come back. Move your foot to the left and to the right this time and come to pigeon. Bring your forearms down and bring your forehead down. Slowly come up. All right, we're gonna do wide leg butterfly here. Very, very close to finished line. Yeah. All right. Open your legs wide. All right, so you will have a few situation here. Some people cannot open so wide with the spine straight. You put your hand behind and push yourself up into an uprising position. Or maybe sit in a block or put a towel under your sit bone. They hold your head or. Alright, so I move myself so you can see my feet here. Yeah. Alright, now toes are pointing up. Alright, and then from here, you are going forward fold as low as you can. If you cannot bring your forearm to the floor, it's okay to put your hands. But when you go down, you want to keep the chest open instead of rounding. Okay. Now slowly bring yourself up. Okay, lie down on your back. All right, and then you give yourself a big hug, holding the knees. Forehead to your knees. And then lower the shoulders down and drop the knees to the left. Cross your right knee over your left, turning the upper body to the right, lower body to the left. Take a twist. And come back. Side two. Left knee over your right, draw the knees to the right, turn your eyes to the left. Come back and take your savasana. Alright, so you guys take your savasana, you don't need to watch me here, you guys all know savasana. So you close your eyes and sit uh, and slide down on the back and just straighten everything out. Lie straight and lie flat. Just another couple minutes and then we're done with the practice.
everyone slowly move your toes and your fingertips and if you are practicing at home and you would like to stay longer in your savasana please feel free to do so 如果留在家里練習你想繼續休息隨便大家 so the rest of you guys slowly come up to sit it 坐回起身 place your hands together in front of your chest 雙手合掌 close your eyes and one ohm to finish your practice today inhale Thank you, Namaste. I see a lot of comments from all over the world. And uh, hello, Becky from USA. Uh, you have been following my classes quite a few times, right? Thank you so much for your support. So um, some of you are telling me you're from Malaysia, you're from New Zealand, you are from Singapore, Taiwan. Oh my goodness, all over the world. So what an honor to have so many different friends from around the world practicing yoga with us here uh, through the internet. So actually, it's a great thing about the internet now. We have no boundaries anymore, right? So um, please do let me know um, your feedback and I'm sure I have a lot of rooms to, imp to improve. Um, once again, thank you so much for your support and I will be teaching here more uh, online. Please check out the schedule and promise if I do it on IG, which I will be doing it tomorrow, I will upload it on my Facebook so you can still see it uh, after 24 hours. Okay, thank you everybody. See you tomorrow. Namaste.